This is Wang. Mrs. Wang, are you with us? Yes. Hi, I'm Paul Rogers. I'm Daniel Scheinert. And I am Daniel Kwan. And today we're going to be talking about editing the audit scene from Everything, Everywhere, All at Once. One way we described this movie early on was that it's a family drama that gets interrupted by a sci-fi film that gets sidetracked by a romance. And in, in the end, it's really just about a family trying to find each other and reach out to each other in the noise of modern life. And the multiverse is sort of a perfect metaphor for that. A karaoke machine could constitute a business expense. I am a singer. This was one of the first scenes Paul cut, and we actually ended up showing it to some of the cast and crew during the shoot. And it was such like a relief to be like, see, it works. I think the first time I cut the scene, I threw it up on frame and through the notes process. We kind of whittled it down to what was important. I loved how specific we could be with the notes. You could hit the exact time code you wanted. You could draw images on top. You could circle the thing that was bothering you. Yeah, we would just note it up, and so Paul would just have a link and be like, well, here's 40 things the Daniels wrote. (laughs) It would import all of their notes into my timeline as markers, so it was really easy to just jump to a note at any point and start working on it. So this is where the family drama, tax drama, kind of slowly transitions into this mysterious action place. And so we're using different language. You know, this kind of zoom in with the camera moving. And yeah, the, and the audio kind of fading into this low-pass background. And it was important to us to have like the visual language and the editing pace be nice and simple for this first section so that you really feel feel something shift. We did a ton of speed ramping in this film, and I got really good at using the the time remapping keyframes, and that became just such a big part of the workflow. That transition was really tough. Yeah, and I remember in Premiere, we were able to temp it up very quickly yeah. with just a sliding split screen. Right. This was probably like our first movie where we were able to do a lot of temp effects just in Premiere. Going to You can't then deduct it if it's an off. Good. Good. They don't know you and I are in this universe yet, so hopefully I'll have some time to explain. I'm not your husband, and he's not the one you know. I'm another version of one from another life path, another universe. I'm here because we need your help. Very busy today. uh. No time to help you. There's a great evil that has taken root in my world, and it's begun spreading its chaos. This whole sequence, we kind of established what the movie's going to feel like when we start intercutting more and more universes. So as we cut it, we were like, when we decide what it sounds like to get sucked into another universe, we're going to use that again and again. I know it's a lot to take in right now. Got to Mrs. Know. Wang. Hello. That's a classic Look, I, Daniels move. It's such a great I, transition between scenes, unexpected, but it works. Then the conversation we are now having concerning your tax liability. I, need I remind you that there's already a lien on your property. I really wanted to make sure that we are with Evelyn as much as possible, just to keep people centered on the fact that what Evelyn is experiencing is what we should be focusing on. But it was hard in this scene because Jamie is killing it off camera right here. (laughs) And we're like, oh, we got to cut. We got to cut away from her. It's not about Deirdre. (laughs) Now you may only see a pile of boring forms and numbers, but I see a story with nothing but a stack of receipts I can trace the ups and downs of your lives. I remember struggling with jumping into that dolly shot in the middle of this, um, but it does such a great job of just making you feel like something's coming. Right, it's when the two genres mix. It's when you take the mundane audit and you put the action movie. You treat it like an action film. People get, their radar goes off and they say, huh, something something interesting is happening. Well, with all of these... um, Honest mistakes, I mean, even if we don't charge you with 
fraud will most certainly have to fine you for gross negligence. You are always trying to confuse us with these big words. I thought you were going to bring your daughter to help you translate. I am going to bring my Sorry. In this scene specifically, there's some split screen stuff. There's a lot of like temp effects, for example, like key in the mirror that were easy to just, you know, within seconds, just mock up and have Premiere just be like, yeah, cool, you can do that. It was pretty great. Are you paying attention? I cannot talk now. Unless you can help me with my taxes. What is gross necklaces? I know you have a lot of things on your mind. But nothing could possibly matter more than this conversation we're having right now concerning the fate of every single world of our infinite multiverse. Where's the respect for our elders? My dear Evelyn, I know you. With every passing moment, you feel you might have missed your chance to make something of your life. I'm here to tell you, every rejection, every disappointment has led you here to this moment. Don't let anything distract you from it. I love her looks at Wayman right now. It's like she's she's seeing him for the first time, finally. Mm. Do you think this is funny? So what will it be? I love the shattered <laughs> subtitles. <laughs> so indulgent. That's, that's a Dan Kwan special. <laughs> Our time here is up. They're gonna kill us. What? Yeah, so that's uh, that's the audit scene from Everything Everywhere All at Once. Hopefully a little insight into our weird process that we invented just for this film, um, but that ended up working out really, really well, thanks to Premiere Pro. I will be in contact soon. I think my other husband is messing up the audit. Maybe we, uh, we can look at all the receipts again. And... <coughs> Push, no one. <laughs> 